permanent brew, permanent brew. Every single tower has the permanent brew buff. What's going on, everybody? My name's Ryan Atuti, and in today's video, we're going to get a brewmaster and make his buff global. That's right, everybody. We have our today. We got ourselves a brewmaster. You know, it's going to be fine, but we're going to be able to and try to put the buff on every single monkey on the entire map. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be crazy. If you guys are excited, you guys know what to do. Hit that like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications. Do I want to put down our hero, our Oven? Oven's pretty powerful. I feel like if we put him down right here, he also increases magic monkeys a bunch. Or, or, or I could just put down this tax shooter and then we'd also be fine. But also submarines because submarines are amazing. Let's put down a free dart monkey right here because it gets like the most vision. And then on top of that, we can get ourselves a submarine, which is going to go right here. Yeah, we want the submarine to be right here. And now we can make sure he has advanced intel. All right, we're ready to start this party. Now he's just gonna go ahead and he, look at it. Look at it, look at the darts. Look how crazy the darts are. They just go wild and pop everything. It's amazing and I absolutely love it. All right, we have, oh, what? Let's turn auto start on. What, Wadu? Okay, so we go ahead. This dart monkey, he's popping them. All right, so I want twin guns and I want air burst darts. Because I feel like once you get air burst starts, then nothing in your life can go wrong. Because you have air burst starts and they're OP and amazing. There we go. They're just so strong. The way they like explode, it's basically like having a triple dart monkey that can hit anywhere on the map. But the challenge or the idea with this plan is I want to have a bunch of monkeys in different areas and I want to get a brewmaster and I want to have to get like a support chinook and then I want to go from spot to pot like moving the permanent brewmaster around so all the monkeys globally have the buff. I think that would be amazing. Eventually, I think I want to get the tax zone and put the tax zone right there. You know what? I feel like the tax zone right there is going to be really, really nice to have. Okay. Triple guns. Triple guns could be pretty nice, but right now we can't hit any lead balloons. We're going to want to be able to pop lead balloons, but they don't show up for a little bit of time, so I think we're going to be okay. Um, let's go ahead and you guys know what's up. Let's get ourselves a triple dart monkey. Maybe here. Let's put a sniper monkey down. And then once we have a sniper monkey here, we can put a sniper monkey down here. All right. Let's do fast firing, even faster firing, full metal jacket. And eventually I want large caliber. Caliber? Caliber. Caliber. I don't know. Now I'm sa I've said it so many times now, it doesn't even sound like a word. Like when you have a word and you say it over and over a word and then it just doesn't sound like a word. Yeah, that's what happened to me. Caliber. 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 Excalibur. I don't know. Now I've gone crazy. What is this madness? All right, monkey sub 600 pops, start monkey 300 pops. This guy is, he's moving up in the world. He's already at 200 pops. This is great. I feel like we want to save up money because we're doing all right. Like we're doing fine. And getting a monkey bank sounds really nice right about now. And besides, I don't know if you can permanent brew monkey farms. Can you? If you can, that's amazing and I want to know more. Can I put, I feel like I want to put my banana farms here. Banana farms are going to go here for now. All right, there we go. Uh, do we have any options for lead balloons right now? I mean, either way, we just, wait, we can't pop that camo balloon. Oh, this isn't good. This is bad. We need something to be able to pop camo balloons. Okay. This guy's already making us some money, which is really nice, but we need to be patient because we're definitely gonna wanna get, I don't know if we want a mortar monkey just because that's the only spot that they meet up, which is right there. So in the meantime, well, lead balloons are about to show up. I want a bomb shoot. Bomb shooter right here. Bomb shooter actually is going to go right here. And then you guys know what's up. Bigger bombs, heavy bombs, frag bombs, cluster bombs. There we go. All right, we already got cluster bombs. Eventually, I want to get recursive cluster. But for right now, I think this is going to do us do just fine. I think this sniper monkey can pop lead balloons. And if that's the case, thank goodness. Can pop lead and frozen beams. Oh, yeah, full metal jacket, which is its first upgrade. That's actually crazy that a sniper monkey can do that. That makes it so much better. Well, while we're waiting though, we definitely want to go ahead and get ourselves another uh, banana farm because, well, banana farms are awesome and we need as many of these guys as we can. Oh, whoopsies, we can't hit camo balloons. Um, all right, let's put a ninja down. Ninja seeking shurikens. Okay, there we go. Uh, sharp shurikens. Okay, there we go. At least we got that going for us now and we can have that. All right, and double shot. All right, well, now we have this ninja down here and he's gonna kind of take care of anything that gets by. Or at least for now, he's going to. We're at seven, almost $7,000 for that. Okay, well, now we're at like $8,000. Okay, that jumps up. That's the amazing thing about banks is once you have all this money, 
in like already in the bank, it just starts skyrocketing, and you're like, all right, we have so much money now. It's amazing. Okay. Nine, oh, look at that. We've already maxed it out. Okay, boom. And then as soon as... All right, we did, we did end up collecting. Yeah, we, did, we have so much money. Okay, this is great. We need to get as many banks as we can, which is a total of, of two banks from that. Well, that's a little bit disappointing. All right, this guy's doing good. Who's popping the most? Here, let's turn this guy into triple. And now... Hmm... So I definitely want to be able... Ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go. We definitely want to be able to pop every type of balloon. So let's put let's put a, a monkey here and let's get shimmer on him. And then we can get wall of fire. And then while we're working on it, let's get another monkey over here. Cause basically we can use these monkeys just to get rid of all the camo, right? So shimmer and then wall of fire. Alright, there we go. So camo is not really gonna be a problem anymore, so he's gonna kinda melt all the balloons that just show up. Oh no, our first Moab! Oh no, will we be able to deal with it? Ooh, we just barely dealt with that. Alright. That could have that could have gone pretty bad. I should have gotten armor piercing darts a little bit sooner, but I'm trying to be greedy, right? Because we got to get that global permanent brew buff, because that's gonna be awesome once we do. It's gonna be awesome, okay? Awesome, I tell you. All right, we have four monkey banks, all upgraded and all good to go. Let's focus more on getting some defense now, though. Let's see. The bomb shooter is doing good. Getting recursive cluster is really nice because that extra that extra damage you get is really good. Let's go ahead and get large caliber on the bait on the sniper monkey and I eventually want to get the semi-automatic because I feel like that's gonna help out a lot. You know? Armor piercing darts. See that's only extra damage against Moab plasma balloons. Oh, interesting. So if they're plasma balloons, it's not gonna work. Huh. One thing we could do though is Necromancer Unpopped Army could be very beneficial if we wanted to pick that up. And just have the balloons kinda go back at them. Um, but that's a total, that's a $6,000 investment on both sides. Well, we need some kind of investment, so let's go ahead and just get that investment. And that's gonna help out a lot, because those types of balloons can pop anything, right? So we really don't need to worry too much about it. More banks, though. Because we're gonna want, oh no, I can't put anything, oh, but I, I can still keep going up. So let's just not worry about it and go up. Up, up, up. Alright, there we go. Can I get one more? Alright, well, I guess I can put a bank right there. And... Hopefully that should be enough banks for now. Uh, just to be safe, let me put down one more bank. One more bank is all I asked for. Oh, okay, we're good. We were able to deal with all that. Now we're gonna need some more here. Let's get armor piercing darts. And we have a lot of towers kind of like all over the place. I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, I guess it works here. Let's get semi-automatic and full auto rifle. All right, well, this guy is insane now. That sniper monkey, he's got nothing to worry about. Okay, well, now we've kind of spread ourselves thin. You guys know what's up now. It's time for our permanent brewmaster. Here, we can put him here. And let's start working on making this guy the permanent brewmaster. So you guys know we want faster throwing. And now we need to get permanent brew, which costs $64,000. We can work on it. We're, it's gonna it's gonna cost a lot of money we are also gonna need to get a support helicopter so we can move them all around the map so that every tower can get the permanent brew buff i need to get more towers down i think it'd be so funny if we just have tons of like random towers like all over the place here i like i like the idea of having this guy right here this druid and then let's druid let's go let's get ball like superstorm eventually but for right now, no thank you. And now let's go ahead and let's make it so hard of oak so we can't have any regrow balloons. Because we don't have anything that stops regrow balloons. So if they come here and he gets hit by that, well now they're not gonna be able to do much. And they're gonna they're gonna be shut down. Oh no, look at all these Moabs. Alright, we got them. We dealt with them. No, nothing to worry about. How's our money? Money? Whoa, we already have forty-three thousand dollars. The banks was definitely a good investment. I kinda want the elite defender, but fifteen thousand very pricey. Very pricey. I really just want to get myself the, the permanent brewmaster. That's going to be like the most important thing. Because look, I mean, he's only popped 30, 300 balloons. Kind of, it's kind of sad. Uh, 20 rounds left. I think we're going to be more than fine. I don't think we have... Why is... Wait, why? Oh, because I put these down. Okay. So 80, 800, 8, oh, there we go. All right. Collect all. All right. So boom. Permanent brew. Okay. So once these guys... Oh! Okay. We're good. Nothing to worry about. Okay, there's always a lot to worry about. All right, let's get ourselves our helicopter. You guys know what's up. I mean, we can, I guess we can put them down. Well, let's just put the helicopter down here so it gets the permanent brew buff. And then pursuit. And now let's get support. Okay. 
So this guy's got permanent. This guy does not. So probably what we want to do now is let's take this guy and move him to right here. So now he can put the buffs on this guy, right? So he's got the buffs, and now he's got the buffs. So he's got buffs, he's got buffs. All right, we just got to keep moving them as often as we can. We need more, though. We're definitely not doing as well as we could. Look at that. Okay, let's get a... Um, I have an idea. I have an idea. Let's get a nice monkey. So we're going to put a nice monkey. We're going to put a nice monkey right here. We're going to get snowstorm, larger radius, refreeze. And you guys know what's up. We need a mortar monkey. At first, I was like, I don't want a mortar monkey. And then I realized, I want a mortar monkey. And I want to put the mortar monkey right there. And I definitely want to get the big one. And then there we go. So now anything that kind of goes in this radius is going to get annihilated. All right. So now let's move this. Let's move our permanent brewmaster down here so these guys can get the buff. All right, so he's got the buff and he's got the buff. All right, next time we can move, we're gonna move. Um, let's get down, let's put down another helicopter. We'll put the helicopter right here. And you know what's up, we'll get another support just so we can move him around even faster and get more. How's our money doing? $26,000 in the bank. Couldn't be asking for more than that. Okay, so now we've got this down. Okay, so let's go ahead and we can move this guy over here. All right, there we go. Now we have almost global, they almost have the buff on them. Yay. And now both of them have it. Yep. Okay. So now we can move this guy over here. Okay. So now the question is, can he buff towers? Does he put... No, he doesn't put permanent brew on defensive support towers. So he only puts them on that. But right now, every tower in the game globally has this effect. That's so cool. Okay. Well, now we just got to keep trying to put down even more towers here. Let's remove this because I really want to put like a, a fire guy in here. You guys know I want Ring of Fire. Cost fifty-one thousand dollars though. How close are we? Oh, we're really close to nine thousand. Let's we'll just save up the money as soon as it gets to like nine thousand. We'll like accept it. There we go. Okay. Now Inferno Ring, and now we definitely want just more attacks and even more attacks. Like we just want more damage, right? But now you guys know what's up. We have to move this guy down here. There we go. Moved him down, and now that guy. Perfect. That got the permanent buff. Well, while we're waiting, let's go ahead and we can get ourselves, let's just put a plane right here. And we can go ahead and get the, um, let's get the Neva Miss Target system. You know, I feel like that's really good. Rapid fire, lots more darts, perfect. This guy's going to be doing tons of damage. Everything's got a buff so far. I kind of want to get, what would be a good ability to get? Let's put a Druid down. Let's just put the Druid right here in the range of this. And let's go and get the jungle bounty because i just think that's really nice to have and then heart of the heart of thunder because heart of thunder is just i like that ability a lot but for the next upgrade that costs fifty four thousand dollars and that's really expensive i don't know if we're gonna get that before round 80 but might as well try we're doing pretty good so far all right there we go but every all right we got to double check permanent brew permanent brew every single tower has the permanent brew buff let's go well except except the alchemist Wait, what if I get an alchemist? Wait, wait, time out. What if I get an alchemist and I get... Can I can I put permanent... Does this guy put it on him? Please tell me it puts it on him. It does not. Oh, that's really unfortunate. That would have been awesome if he put the effect on himself. All right, we're at round 78 and we're doing super good. We have 500 lives as well. So, I mean, it works for us, right? We need still need a lot of money. How's we looking for that? We're at 20,000. Oh, that's so close. Wait. Yeah, we're so close. Collect all. There we go. Okay, Spirit of the Forest. Yay! Spirit of the Forest is such a nice upgrade to have. All right. One more round is this. Oh, my gosh. Look at this guy, like, flick back and forth. He's going crazy. Look at him. He's doing 360 no-scopes. All righty. How much money is these guys? Doing? I guess it doesn't really say. It just says how many pops. So it's a mixture of pops and money that they made for you. This, these wizard monkeys are no joke. They both popped a lot. Those wizard monkeys turned out to be really, really useful. But there we go, everyone. That was the global brewmaster buff uh, challenge. I don't know what you want to call it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe. Check out my Twitch where I stream daily, which is in the description down below. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, everyone. Whoa!